Well, it's uh, you know, it's one of those bittersweet days. Um, you know, you never like seeing these in a season end, um, but this this team has so much to celebrate from this season. You know, it's really truly a great season. Um, I'm really proud of the work these guys put in. I'm I'm especially proud of our seniors who uh, <clears throat> established a heck of a leadership role within this team. Um, relatively young club out there in a lot of ways, and these guys, uh, we, we laugh a little bit about it because uh, they dealt with some diaper changes along the way, like you do with some youngsters, you know. But um, tonight's ball game was a was a, a tough battle. It started out tough, you know. Uh, both pitchers were were throwing a lot of pitches, along, you know, but uh, we were battling out there. Thought we had some opportunities early that uh, we didn't quite take advantage of, and. You know, hats off to Calhoun. They got on one of their nice runs again where they, I think they backed up seven or eight hits that one inning and scored five. And uh, they've done that a couple times to us. So, uh, But our kids never stopped fighting. They never stopped competing. And uh, we gave ourselves a chance to get back into this ball game and, and almost came up with those two ninth inning wins that we talked about. So uh, we just ran out of ninth innings. So appreciate it. Coach, uh, talk about how you guys kept responding every time Kyler would take the lead. You kept tying the game up. Yeah, that, you know that's something that that um, that, that we, we we talk about as a team. We talk about momentum. We talk about those things. But you know, Calu also kept coming and putting pressure on us, and uh, they made it tough. You know, when you when you're down and you're chasing, it's tough to always come back. But but our guys did battle. Um, you know, we we had a, we had a great shot in the arm in that eighth inning. Um, had a chance to extend that a little bit. It didn't happen. You know, that's that's part of the baseball game. And, uh, you know, even in the ninth inning, you know, I mean, we, we saw you know, our guys hit the ball hard three times, just happened to hit them right at the shortstop and didn't find the hole. And I think that was a benefit from the other night when we talked. Uh, they brought their closer in, and we had a little bit of familiarity with them, and that was from battling the other night too. So, uh, you know, we talk about that stuff with tournaments like this, and our guys responded, and I'm really proud of them. And saying you came up with a hit to the <coughs> game in the third, what were you looking for on the RBI single? Uh, I was just looking to be aggressive early in the count. Um, just want to tip my cap to their pitcher. He's throwing strikes. He's challenging us a lot. Um, so I wanted to get something early in the count. Luckily, he threw me a fastball. Uh, I think after throwing ball one, um, and it turned on it, was able to knock in uh, Quadi. And then, Chris, you hit that. Uh, home run um, in the fifth after they put up five and fourth. Uh, talk about where you were looking for and how important that was. At the time. Well, uh, found a 1 0 count and I was looking for a fastball up. He threw it and I made sure not to miss it. You know, Carmody got on base to start that inning and I just wanted to keep it, keep it rolling. And then um, Chris and Singh kind of talk about how. Great this ride has been for you guys as seniors. Uh, it's awesome. I mean, at one point in the season we were two and six. At another point in the season we were fifteen and fifteen. Um, and then to come out and win like fifteen of sixteen to get to where we are right now. Um, that's just a testament to how we approach the game. Um, as a team, we always had each other's backs. We always um, found ways to win, and at that point, it was fun. There was a time where we hit really rock bottom, um, and just to see the team respond in a positive manner was just awesome. And then coming to this stage for the first time in 30 years is something that's going to stay in our memories um, with each other, with our friendships for forever. I'm um, just thankful to be here. Yeah, I mean, Everyone fought for each other, focused up, and made some adjustments. I mean, last year we had a pretty successful year, but we had to shift our focus because we had a different identity this year. So we had to go through a little, little change with that. But um, going through that whole process, everyone bought in, started playing the game. I mean, we always played the game the right way. And, you know, we just wanted to be successful for each other. And Coach, you talked about on Thursday how your teammates had gone to the championship where you'd missed that opportunity. Um, now, looking back on the last three or four days, um, how was the experience 
uh, compared to their descriptions? No, it's truly a wonderful experience. I mean, I think uh, I think the city of Appleton does a great job with it. I think the committee people here do a great job with it. You know, all the way up up and down the line. Um, you know, and and to get here with these guys um, really really is a special thing for me that I'll always cherish. Um, you know, I came came back here just a couple of years ago, and I was the new kid on the block for these guys, and they're kind of wondering what they're getting. So uh, to grow with these guys and watch them them um, kind of embrace things, it's really special. Um, the, the guys that the last time North Central was in, like I said, it was a, a year after I graduated, and a lot of my teammates were here, and you know they were here with us this weekend, and whether it was actually here physically or email messages or text messages, those type of things. It was, a, it was a great show of support from uh, Cardinal Nation, and uh, we really appreciate that.